two of the guys in my sales department came up to me yesterday and they said, Jason, great news. We just closed a $40,000 deal. 20,000 of those dollars are hitting our account today. Just wanted to let you know. And I said, hey, that's awesome. Great news. Keep it up. Fast forward to today. One of them, the boss, came to me and said, hey, actually, not so sure about that $40,000 deal. The money hasn't hit our account. We can't get a hold of the customer and I'm not really sure what's going on. I'm going to do my best, but I really don't know. What's the moral of the story? It's simple. Never celebrate until the deal's done. I'm here to tell you that these two guys, and I respect both of them a lot, they're great guys, they're valuable parts of the team, but they were celebrating yesterday. They were celebrating like they had already scored the touchdown and that the ball had already been in the end zone, when in reality, it wasn't. I'm here to tell you that whether you're trying to close deals as a salesperson, whether you're trying to buy a business or a piece of property, or in whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to execute, never celebrate until the deal is done, until the ink is dried, and until you're certain that the money's moved from one side of the table to the other. And once you get that ball in the end zone, before you celebrate, look to make sure there's not a flag on the field. Make sure there's not a penalty. Make sure there's not any way or any reason whatsoever that that deal could get turned around. Because I'm here to tell you that salespeople and deal people who celebrate before the deal is done are the ones that get burned. I'm telling you, your ability to not celebrate prematurely will help you close so many more deals because you'll stay focused, your eye will be on the prize, you're keeping track of everything, you're not getting high in the sky, a little over your skis. Those who celebrate prematurely get burned. Take that to the bank.